Hi friends, welcome to my channel and this is Windows Server 2019 training tutorial and this is number 9 video in this series and today in this video I am going to show you how to remove and or demote additional domain controller on Windows Server 2019 so in last few videos we have created some domain controllers and additional domain controllers so um, in this video I am going to focus on uh, demoting additional domain controller from uh, domain infrastructure or forest infrastructure which is running on Windows Server 2019 so let's get in so this is uh, active directory domain services removal workflow which is uh, uh, basically uh, published by Microsoft so you can see from here uh, what we have to do um, from server manager we uh, we need to go to server manager dashboard and then we need to select the um, select server from a server pool and then we can select AD and DNS and uh, if we have imported uh, import file we can select it and remove role and features and then we have a server selection what server you want to select and then you need to select the role which role you want to remove like active directory and DNS uh, and then it's going to give you the validation result after the validation result you need to type the correct credential and uh, after validating the credential it's going to give you some warning and removal option uh, DNS delegation everything and then finally you need to set the re new password for administrator because after removing the active directory domain services and demoting the server from a domain uh, from a domain controller role it's not going to be a part of domain it's going to be a uh, after reboot it's going to come in work group or work group uh, um, domain so you need to make sure you have a, uh, a local administrator credential to log into the what uh, uh, your server which you have demoted and after confirmation it's going to get uh, demoted and then you're going to get the result so we will follow this instruction uh, one by one step by step in our demo environment where we are going to demote the server so let's get in what is my lab infrastructure so we have uh, two domain controllers. The, the first one is Win2K19 DC01 and second domain controller is Win2K19 DC02 which is my second domain controller. So let's check. So basically this is my DC01 you can see from here Active Directory and DNS role on this machine and this is DC01 and this is DC02 which we are going to decommission and demote the, in this video so Win2K19 DC02 and Active Direct Indian's role is running on this machine and if I go to tools Active Direct users and computers you will be able to see here we have two domain controllers DC01 and DC02 both are global catalog servers so this machine we are going to demote now DC02 so to do it first I'm going here on DC02 and from manage I'm going to select remove role and features then click next and this is going to what I'm going to select my server here so select server so I'm going to select my server click next and then what role we need to remove so server uh, roles I'm going to select here my Active Directory domain services and click remove so this is going to run now validation result and it's going to give us validation result so here you can see the validation result and the validation process found the problem on this server this need to be removed from so domain controller need to demote from the Active Directory uh, role so we need to go ahead and demote this server from a domain controller and then this is going to give us credential so uh, this is what it's have so force the removal for this domain controller and then uh, you can see here get credential wizard we have inserted the credential and then it's going to give you warning that the server will be automatically restarted after demotion operation so click next and then what what the role this machine have the domain controller currently hosting DNS and global catalog so I'm okay to remove both these things so click next and then we have to type the new administrator credential here you can see 
uh, new administration credential and confirm the administration administrator password once again so click next and now it's going to give you the review option which we have here uh, removal option un after resetting the new uh, new administrator password so this is what it's going to do remove active directory domain services from this computer without updating for this metadata so the uh, metadata we need to update manually so this is fine and now I'm going to click on demo so we have a control over the metadata cleanup completely it's not going to do uh, any changes in metadata file which is good so in active directory database so let's wait now you can see it's processing and it's deleting the root and everything from this machine and after reboot this is automatically going to reboot this machine and post reboot this machine is going to be come under work group so currently you can see this is domain controller and this has been moved to work group now it's no more in AD so we have to get the, uh, uh, after reboot we have to log into this machine by using local administrator credential so it's going to take few minutes or few seconds to complete this activity and then it's going to remove reboot the server so the motion is still running you can see so you can see active directory domain services successfully deleted from this uh, registry so DNS service has been also deleted from the server so this is good so successfully demoted the active directory domain controller so we are good and now it's automatically going to reboot this machine so now uh, we got to know the machine has been um, successfully demoted and now we can go ahead and delete this domain controller DC02 from active directory uh, and from inside from the domain controllers so click delete and are you sure want to delete the computer name this you have to make sure you are deleting the correct domain control so yes I want to delete DC02 and now delete the domain controller anyway so yeah, it's saying you need to go here and run the DC promo so we did this already we have uh, remove the role and features wizard from server manager so we are good and delete the domain control anyway it's permanently offline and can be uh, and um, can no longer uh, um, be using uh, remove wizard so good we are, we are good to go and delete this machine so delete this active directory domain control is a global catalog so you want to continue with deletion yes I have another global catalog server here in domain so this is good uh, delete and now you can see the machine has been deleted from domain controllers and now we can go and see the active directory site and services and from the active directory site and services we can see this machine is uh, still there but it's not uh, showing any domain related domain or DC type so we can clean up so this is done so we are good with this and now if I go here to the user in computer and on the victor local right click and change domain controller you will see only we have only one domain controller now which is DC01 so DC02 has been deleted from um, uh, metadata of this uh, domain controller database so this is good and now if I go to DC02 and hit control to Dell and type the credential of administrator which we have uh, said during the uh, demotion of this machine so now wait for the server manager and we will able to see this machine is no more uh, available in domain so you can see this machine is now under the work group so this is good and now you can see active directory and DNS rule is still installed on this machine but it's not promoted this machine is not promoted you will see promote this uh, server as a domain control so we can go ahead and click here and remove role and features from now and I'm going to select the dish, uh, domain controller and 
now we can select DNS and active directory domain services so now it's going to remove all the features and these two roles which is related it with active directory domain services so next next and restart the destination computer automatically so what it's going to uh, remove it's going to remove active directory domain services and DNS and the management tools also so this removal is going to take less than a minute I guess and post this installation we are good to reboot this machine and verify there was uh, active directory and DNS role is uninstalled from this machine so now removal is almost 70 percent completed it's going to take few more seconds here now machine is rebooting automatically rebooting after uninstalling those role active directory and DNS and post the uh, reboot we this machine is completely going to be clean from DOM active directory and DNS and we have also cleaned the, our AD infrastructure from DC02 uh, which was there in as a domain controller so now our active directory is healthy and it's not having domain controller DC02 which was earlier there so we have demoted that successfully and if I log in again to this machine DC02 you will see this machine is no more going to have a active directory and DNS role anymore so it's still it's going to take few seconds more I guess So removal succeeded on DC02 and now this machine having not having active directory and DNS role installed so this is good so we have successfully demoted this server from additional domain controller and we are good to shut down this machine and if this is a physical server you can remove it from a power uh, you can remove it from server rack remove the power cable network and everything and if this is a virtual machine it's make our life easier we can just right click and delete this uh, machine from desk and you can completely delete this machine from Hyper-V or VMware whatever uh, hypervisor is running so this is all about removing the Active Directory or uh, additional domain controller from uh, or demoting the additional domain controller from the Active Directory infrastructure. And thank you for watching and please subscribe me for more videos. And if you have any query, any question related to this video, you can always post me on my given mail IDs. Thank you once again. Bye bye.